Um, why are... Okay. Hey everyone, and welcome back to Style Savvy Fashion Forward. It is at the end of the fashion show, which we completed in the last episode, and something is happening. Everyone, can I have your attention, please? I need you to go back to the stage so we can take a photo. Ah. This is what we've been waiting for. Oh my gosh, Adelaide. So tragic. Palace wall. Ooh, I'll take that. Men's fashion has been added to the other menu on the title screen. Oh, okay. Change character has been added to the other menu on the title screen. Change your in-game looks however you want at any time. Well, that's pretty cool. So we'll definitely have to check that out. I've heard that the options for men's clothing is very limited, though. Like, some people were not super happy with the options, but we can still check it out nonetheless. Check out our billboard. Looking cute. All right, so I changed up my outfit a little bit and my tiny hat grew into a full-sized hat. Look at that. So we are going to check out the boutique and see if anything's going on there. Since we finished the fashion show, I don't know if there's going to be a cutscene. I, yeah, I kind of assumed there would be. So let's see. Kira, you were amazing in the fashion show. You weren't too bad yourself, you know. Hey, guess what Ricky just told us? You'll never guess. But guess, he said we're going to take the next fashion show to a whole new level. Now Adelaide's on board, Ricky's going to have more options for the show. We'll be able to choose the show's theme and how the stage will look. Yay, now you can have the show you've always dreamed of. Banana fashion show, it's going to happen. Also, tiny hat fashion show. Talk to Ricky at the arena if you want to make decisions about the stage or theme. Oh, and there's something else I wanted to tell you. We're gonna have more models on the catwalk. Yeah, up until now it was just the three of us, but that's about to change. Now more and more girls wanna take part in the fashion shows, so there'll be more models than just us. Once we decide the theme, the models will come to the boutique to get their clothes sorted out. I know you'll come up with wonderful outfits to match the theme. All this competition just makes me wanna be an even greater model. Isn't this just so exciting? You know what? It actually is. Anyway, Kita, keep up the amazing work. So I guess we can like set the kind of fashion show we want, like a uh, theme if we want to have a rock or a gothic or something like that. Uh, so I'm not, I'm not sure what I want to do first. Probably chic because <laughs> then we can sell a lot of chic clothing because I think after you do a fashion show with a certain theme, uh, a bunch of people will come in and ask for clothes like that. So it actually helps out the store. So that's definitely something that we could do. I think I have some pictures for Rainbow. So I'm going to take them to her and show you guys if I get any new colors. All right, so we got Seaside Terrace and Mahogany. And I got that from the little cafe that's on the beach which uh, it was at night. I don't know if that matters, but that's the picture. So we got Midnight Ocean, Night Zephyr, Night Sand. Oh, we got a red floor from her as well. Uh, so I got all of those colors from showing her this picture, which is just me on the beach at night because they're all dark colors and they have night in the name. I'm assuming it has to be nighttime to get those colors. I got Starcrossed Sky. And that is another beach picture at night. Basically, when I was playing at night the other day, I went through and just snapped as many pictures as I could to try to get more colors. This is really close to this, like, I think it's a bell, um, but it's overlooking the ocean, so. Okay, so I got Nocturne Blue, Metropolis Navy, and that was from a nighttime photo of the city, which I can never remember what the name is. But it's me eating a crepe in the city. All right, Amethyst Sky. So I got that one from showing her uh, this picture from the amusement park, which is me on the Ferris wheel at night. And we got Mary Go Green, which looks more like yellow. And we got a pink floor. 
And that came from standing in front of the merry-go-round at night. So we got that color from this picture. And now we've got bunny purple. And that's also from the amusement park at night. So it seems like you get a lot of colors if you go to the amusement park at night. And that was just in front of this bunny sign at the amusement park. So we got piano, elegant rose, piano as a color. Uh, so I got that from the restaurant, which if you go at night, there is a girl playing the piano and you can also play it yourself if you want to. So that is how I got that picture. Owl stone. <laughs> what a great name for a color. So that color came from this picture, which is me standing next to the owl statue in Maple Crescent. And this was at night. I don't know if that makes a difference. Probably not. And then I got lantern light toast and toasted sesame um, from another picture in Maple Crescent, which is in front of the lights, which they kind of allude to that they look different at night. So I got that. And then we got peaceful purple and that comes from the meadow and that's at night. So it came from this picture. And Chimney Soot, which I think also came from Meadow. Yeah, it came from this over overview photo. All right, On Air Ash. <laughs> and I got that one from going to a concert at night and taking a picture there. All right, so we got Begonia. And that's from going to the cafe on the beach during the day, or at least it was around sunset, I think. So that's how you get that. And we got starfish orange, which comes from the beach. As you might imagine, came from this picture right here, which again, this is like at sunset. So I don't know if you can get this picture just regularly during the day or if it actually has to be around sunset because the colors do look a little bit different. So I don't, I'm not sure if that matters, or if it just has to be during the day. All right, so let's check out our color palette here, see what we're what we're missing. Snow White, I'm willing to bet we're not gonna get that uh, unless it's winter. Station Gray, I thought I took a picture of the station though. Hmm. Got a couple blues missing, Bicycle Blue, I thought I got that one. Cause there is a, Oh, it tells you, like, the date and everything. Because there is a bicycle outside of the boutique, but I swore I got that one. Guess not. Star Cerulean, Enchanted Night. Star Cerulean is probably at the beach, maybe? Looks like we got all the blue purples. Missing two purples. Red Currant Cake. Hmm. So that's going to be a food. Exotic Grape. All right. Missing two pinks. Cherry Blossom, and Celebration Pink. Hmm. Oh, we're missing a lot of reds. Oh. Yeah, that one we probably won't be able to get into winter. Fiery Rose, Rooibos Tea, Chocolate Cake, Night Rose. Uh, I wonder where they could be. Sunlight Sand. Hmm. That should be at the beach somewhere. Sawtooth Oak, Tiramisu, that might be a winter, a winter one. Workbench, Workbench Brown, Science Lion, Science Lion? Antique Door, only missing one orange, which is Maple. Golden Arch, Golden Bell. I took a picture in front of the bell though. The, um, the one at the beach. I wonder if it has to be a certain time of day get that. Maybe we'll take some pictures today. Shrub Green, Garden Gate, and Green Shadow. And then Emerald Ocean and Winter Green. Well, Winter Green we can't get yet, but I, I don't know what season. I don't know if, if any of these will show up in fall because we're kind of getting close to fall, so maybe, maybe we can get some of the colors then. I don't know. I'm trying really hard to find as many of them on my own as I can without using a guide. I have not looked at a guide thus far for the color palette, so I'm kind of trying to see how many I can get by myself first. So, 
working on that. Uh, we still haven't unlocked something in the arcade. I'm not sure what goes there. Let's head to the station. And... I don't... I don't know, like... Station Gray? Why can't we... Why can't we get that? I definitely think I've taken a picture here before. Hmm. Well, let's go to... Why don't we go to the meadows? Let's take a little trip to the meadows. Okay, um... Why are you here? This is a fortune teller. I knew you'd come here. Answer my simple questions and I will tell your fortune. Okay. Is this gonna be the same quiz or is it gonna be different? This is gonna be the same one. All right, well, we don't need to see that. Uh, I mean, she gave me a meadow floor for doing that, but that was like the same exact quiz. So what the heck? Why? I guess we'll just find her around because she disappeared. So we haven't gone into this house yet. It did unlock uh, when I was here taking pictures the other night, but I didn't go in there. Or at least, I don't think the family was home or something, so... Maybe we can go in this time. It's fairly cool here, despite being the middle of summer. I'm really enjoying it. The evenings can get a little chilly, though, so I made sure to bring some warm clothes with me. Well, that's good to know. I am currently deliberating on what to prepare for her ladyship's next meal. Great. So, can we not go in there? Maybe we have to come back at a different time? Maybe? Huh. Well, this is a fun trip. All right, I wanted to go to the beach because the last time I was here, there was somebody with sparkles and I didn't talk to them because I didn't want you guys to miss that. So let's talk to them now. Where be me buried treasure? Ha, did I scare you? My next audition is for the role of a scary pirate, which is why I'm trying to keep in character. Costume is homemade, of course. I didn't get the last role, so I'm going all out for this one. Full sail, hole away. Arr, avast there, matey. That was fun. Are you gonna tell me about a color that I probably already have? Yes, you go to the cafe for sweets. You can get tiramisu there? I thought you could only get coffee. What? What? Well, that's where we get that color. All right, let's take a picture with this bell because maybe it has to be full daytime for you to get for you to get that one so let's take a picture while I'm here I wonder where that that girl is gonna go because we've seen her several times oh hey it's Xiaoling what's up Kira I'm waiting for Callie I want to show her how different I look in this new outfit I wonder if she'll be surprised maybe she won't even recognize me I'm so excited! Where is she? I can't wait to show her. I'm just gonna pull out my sketchbook and wave right here. I'm glued to this spot. Hmm? <laughs> okay. Who is that? That's not Callie. What you doing? Oh, Kita, are you here to be drawn too? You don't know? This is where you come to get your portrait done. Xiaoling's portraits are getting really popular lately. She makes them look exactly like the subjects, but cuter. All right, it's ready. Your reputation is well-deserved. You're really good. Do you think so, really? Of course, and not just me either. Everybody's saying it. You have a really unique style. No one has seen anything like it before. Stop it, you're making me blush. Actually, Kita, I'm sure you've had customers bringing portraits to the boutique, right? Well, you can be pretty certain those were Xiaoling's portraits. I don't think that's ever happened. No, I don't think that's ever happened. Really? Has that really happened? You're embarrassing me, but I'm really happy to hear it. I'm gonna keep on drawing portraits from now on. She ended up sounding a lot like Sophie. I don't remember what her voice was. <laughs> We haven't seen her in, like, a hundred years, so... Oh, well. So, that bicycle is, like, right there. 
But I'm, I swear I showed her a picture with the bicycle in it before. So I don't understand why we don't have that color yet. All right, uh, let's, let's go to the cafeteria and see if we can get some food, maybe. Hi, Evie. I've been thinking about hairstyles. Can you tell me about grandma? Have you heard of fashion one? Whoa, I didn't know we could actually have a conversation. I just wanted to take a picture. Oh, that's right. You've been doing a bit of work at the hair salon, haven't you? What with the boutique and the hair salon, you must be really busy. You know, hairstyles really reflect each person's individuality. In my opinion, even more so than clothing or makeup. So to keep your customers happy, you have to listen to them. If you really listen, they will tell you everything you need to know. Yes, okay, yeah. I get that. Oh, hey. Hair salon miniatures. That's cool. I really didn't want to talk to her. I just wanted to get... Yeah, well, maybe I'll get some, uh... No, see, you can only get tea. Maybe you can only get the desserts in winter? Or another season? Maybe... I don't know. I didn't have the option to get tiramisu, so... Eh. Um... Why are... Okay. Yikes! Oh no, I've been spotted. What am I to do? Uh, good morrow. I don't believe we've had the pleasure of meeting. My name is Lord B. What, what's wrong? Why are you looking at one's face so closely? Oh, you want one's glasses, is that it? Well, you can't have them. Nope, I'll not budge on this issue. I know, how about I teach you this instead? Ooh, sausage curls. I actually really like that hairstyle, so I'm glad that we got it. Finally. I was waiting for that. Learn to style such lavish ringlets and you will no doubt give off an air of sophistication. Even without glasses such as these. Oh my, would you just look at the time? I really must be getting on. Until next time, my sweet doodle pip. That was the thing that happened in my life. Okay. A hairstyle fit for nobility. I wonder if this person lives in that house in the meadows. Well, let's, uh, let's see what, uh, these would look like on me. This new hairstyle. And no, we never do surprise me. I don't trust you at all. Alright, wh where is it? Wow. That would look terrible on me. We're not gonna do that, but I am glad to have it, because I think... I think that's one of the few hairstyles I was missing, because I think I have most of them. But... Oh, hello. Oh no, that's... Was she...? Yeah, she was standing here before. We could do our makeup set, because we never did that. <laughs> so if you go onto the second floor, you should be able to talk to Tarquin and... <laughs> Finally, um do a makeup set, which he told us about, like, how many episodes ago. Alright, makeup lab. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I want to go to the makeup lab. Exciting. Alright, so... No, I want to make one. Makeup box? Okay, we already have that set, but how do I actually make one? Oh, so I can change this one? But what if I want to make a different one? Like, how do I... How do I do that? We only have one set. How do I get more to change? I want to make a banana set. <laughs> you must be very good. Like... Well, we'll have to do that later when I figure out how to get more makeup sets. <laughs> Alright, well, why don't we check out the arena and see what we can do here. So, what do we got for themes? Uh, summer Romance. Stage is set for Summer Romance and you're in the leading role. Make sure you look the part with a cute outfit. 
sassy summer queen. Oh my gosh, I feel like we already have a winner, but I guess I'll look at the other ones anyway. It's summer, roll it like you're the queen of cool you are with a truly sensational summer outfit. Blow away the competition. Oh my goodness. Summer sunshine, can you come up with an outfit as bright as the summer sun? Get everyone in the mood for fun with a summer outfit. Cool in the summer. Summer may be hot, but with the right outfit, you can forget all about it. Pick out something cool and graceful for adults. Summer holiday love. Doesn't the summer make you feel like you're on holiday? Wear your best summer outfit and look out for love. The stage is yours. Set the stage the way you like. It's your show, your rules. Have fun and aim for number one. Well, I mean, as much as I would love to do that, and we will do that, we have to do Sassy Summer Queen. It, like, it, it needs to happen. It needs to happen. So that's our theme. Choose a venue. What? Yes, I didn't. What can we do? Ooh. I didn't know this was a thing. I wish we had more options, though. These are all a little bit pink. Which is fine for, like, one or two of them, but there's three of them that are... All pretty pink. Uh, let's do this one. Okay. I don't think we've sold any tickets for this yet. Oh. How did I get these people? I did nothing. <laughs> I don't recall selling any fashion show tickets. Oh well. We already have a couple people there. Okay. What? Who are you? Cat girl? Meow, meow, meow. What's up? Meow. I'm a cat. Meow. Don't understand what you're saying because I'm a cat. Meow. Ugh. Why are you looking at me all funny? Something wrong? Meow. I know. Why don't you become a cat too? Oh, sweet. I didn't realize this was a hairstyle. It looks more like a bow to me, but okay. If you make your hair into cat ears like this, we can be friends. <laughs> I have to go now. Time for food. Meow you later. Please don't eat cat food. It's not... Don't eat it. She's gonna go eat cat food, isn't she? Well. Wow, what a productive episode. <laughs> so, we got a bunch of colors. We got some new hairstyles, which is pretty exciting. But I think that is going to do it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up to share support. It really helps me out. So thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next one.